Hi, this is Dr. Luke at Clearside Center in Oklahoma City, and this is how I perform photorefractive keratectomy, also known as PRK. So here we're, I'm just getting the eye ready for surgery, and the first thing we start with is to move the eyelids and eyelashes out of the way. This is very comfortable. You know, the eyes are numb at this point, and the patient really shouldn't feel anything more than some minor pressure. There's just a little device to help keep the eyes open. I ask the patient to look up at the bright green blinking light. And here I'm just getting the eye in focus. And I applied another anesthetic drop just to be sure that the patient doesn't feel anything. Now here I'm using 20% alcohol. Uh, and, I, and what this does is it loosens the epithelium or the skin on the eye, which, uh, which has to be removed prior to bringing the eye into focus with the laser. I do this for approximately 25 to 30 seconds, making sure to get all of the epithelium and not touching the stem cells on the uh, outer aspect of the, the cornea known as the limbus. During this time, of course, the patient's vision is blocked, and I just ask the patient to look straight ahead. This is not uncomfortable. Again, a little bit of pressure is all that somebody would feel during this. And I remove the excess alcohol with BSS, which is a kind of uh, saline solution. And I use a surgical sponge to remove the now loose epithelium. Again, all of this is very comfortable. And you can see that that comes off very nicely in a circular pattern, which is what I want. All right, and here I'm just touching up the edges. I want to make sure that I'm treating as much of the cornea as possible with. Uh, with the laser. Now this is not a sharp instrument. It's very dull and again just making sure that the edges look absolutely perfect. Now the patient is very relaxed at this point and then the last thing I use is a surgical sponge to make sure it looks I have all the epithelial cells. Now here, this is where I'm using the laser to bring the eye into focus. We have the fastest laser available, which is also, which has been shown to provide extremely great visual outcomes. This next sponge is the uh, is filled is uh, moistened with mitomycin C. It's an anti-inflammatory and one of the biggest advances in PRK surgery. This uh, decreases the risk for any kind of scarring or um, adverse healing. And I just Then I rinse it out with uh, PSS again, again that saline solution. Then the next thing I use is a very cool, almost frozen surgical sponge, which has been shown to decrease discomfort during the healing process. I then use broad spectrum antibiotics as well as steroids in order to prevent infection and to help prevent overhealing. The last thing I use is a contact lens, and this is just a barrier to the outside world while the uh, eye is healing. And this is typically removed four to seven days later. Thank you.